Hi everyone, uh, my name is Ken Kato from uh, National Cancer Center Hospital Tokyo. Uh, I'm a medical oncologist. Uh, my specialty is uh, upper GI, uh, medical oncology, uh, chemotherapy and chemoradiation therapy for uh, the gastric cancer and the spagal cancer. Uh, today's my talk is about the, the gastric cancer and the, the title of my presentation is a comprehensive review of gastric cancer and current chemotherapy for metastasis. Uh, as you know, the uh, incidence of gastric cancer is uh, uh, dominant in the uh, Eastern Asia and in the, uh, South America. The incidence of gastric cancer is uh, higher in Japan and Korea and uh, China. On the other hand, the uh, uh, incidence is uh, relatively lower in the uh, United States and the uh, United Kingdom. And uh, this is the reason why uh, the gastric cancer chemotherapy uh, development is not uh, rapidly progressed. So this is the cancer statistics in Japan. Uh, the gastric cancer is a leading cause of the, uh, the uh, cancer uh, for a long time. Uh, but uh, recently, the incidence of the gastric cancer is uh, decreased and the mortality is uh, uh, decreased uh, also uh, because uh, uh, the, most of the gastric cancer uh, diagnosis uh, in earlier stages and the, uh, the treated with uh, endoscopic resection. And also the, uh, the one of the main cause of the gastric cancer is a uh, uh, helicopter pyro infection. But in the recent three, uh, the antibiotics and the, uh, the incidence of the Helicobacter pylori infection uh, have decreased. Uh, so that is the main cause of the uh, decreasing of the incidence of the gastric cancer. And the lung cancer and the colorectal cancer uh, goes to the reading uh, cancer in Japan. So this is the surveillance system in Japan. Uh, in Japan, the uh, medical checking up uh, was uh, uh, done by uh, such kind of the, uh, the bus in the uh, school or uh, not, not school, but in the uh, office. And then uh, we done the, uh, that kind of the uh, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the test examination and then the endoscopy was easily done by the uh, endoscopist and then we found the uh, gastric cancer in the earlier stage without the symptom and the uh, endoscopic resection was uh, 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 easily done by the endoscopist a uh, patient uh, should be uh, administered the hospital uh, within the weeks and then a uh, patient can uh, eat uh, immediately after the uh, discharge uh, after the endoscopy section. Okay. So uh, my uh, specialty is the chemotherapy so I would like to talk about the chemotherapy uh, for advanced gastric cancer. And the, the, uh, there is some uh, uh, trials was done uh, before 2005. So firstly, uh, this is a first report compared to the best supportive care uh, versus chemotherapy in the uh, advanced gastric cancer. Pamtex uh, is a, a, a combination therapy, the 5FE and the adrenomycin and the mesotrexate. It shows a, a better survival compared to the best supportive care uh, in the advanced gastric cancer patient. And then uh, in the uh, 20th century, the some uh, uh, clinical trials uh, compared the best of supportive care versus chemotherapy was done and the, the most of uh, the, uh, the trials shows a, a better tendency of the uh, chemotherapy for the advanced, uh, advanced gastric cancer uh, patient. But the uh, uh, median survival time was uh, around 10 months uh, even for the uh, 
uh, the intensive chemotherapy. And after that, uh, the summer Greek trial was done in the Japan and Korea and the uh, East and Western countries compa comparison between the uh, chemotherapeutic regimen. So sometimes monotherapy versus uh, the combination therapy was uh, ex examined in the clinical trials. And but it, uh, not so all the uh, trials shows a uh, uh, benefit uh, uh, with the uh, combination therapy. In Japan, uh, JCO 9205 was done in the uh, 1990s. Uh, this trial was a comparison with the uh, uh, 5FU monotherapy process, 5FU plus uh, cisplatin process, UFT plus mitomycin C. After the uh, start of the uh, clinical trials, the UFT plus mitomycin C uh, was eliminated due to the uh, higher uh, toxicity. So these trials was uh, done uh, by comparison with uh, 5FU monotherapy with uh, 5FU and cisplatin. The toxicity is uh, uh, seen uh, higher in the cisplatin combination therapy, and uh, more than 30% of the uh, non hematologic toxicity was seen in the cisplatin combination, mainly the nausea and the vomiting. But the response rate is uh, uh, most high, highest in the 5 FU cisplatin. But the median survival time is uh, uh, comparable uh, between the 5 FU and the, uh, the 5 and cisplatin and uh, a similar uh, one year survival uh, rate was uh, between the 5FU and the uh, 5FU cisplatin. Uh, this is the overall survival curve uh, in the Fajerico uh, 9205. The low, lowest uh, survival was seen in the UFT plus vitamin C and the 5FU monotherapy and 5FU and cisplatin was uh, similar. So the, they conclude the 5FU uh, monotherapy was standard regimen uh, from the result of the JCOB 9205 in Japan. Uh, but it, uh, uh, in Western countries, and uh, uh, some uh, clinical trials show the benefit with uh, combination therapy, uh, mainly the 5FU uh, plus platinum agent. So this is a, a, a different uh, chemo standard chemotherapy between the Western countries and the Japan. And the Inutokan was approved uh, in Japan the late late of 1990s. And the taxan is also approved for gastric cancer. And the, uh, we have a four uh, drugs for that one's gastric cancer in, uh, at the beginning of the two, uh, uh, 21 centuries. So S1 is the uh, oral flow procedure uh, containing the tegaful uh, plus oteracil potassium and gimeracil. Uh, tegaful was uh, converted to 5-FU and the gimeracil inhibit the DPD and it uh, enhanced the, uh, uh, the uh, eff uh, efficacy of the uh, tegaful. And the oteracil potassium uh, decreases the gastrointestinal toxicity caused by the 5FU. So in Japan, uh, the clinical trial is done with uh, S S1 monotherapy. JCO 9912 trial is a comparison with the 5FU monotherapy versus uh, cisplatin plus irinotecan uh, CPT11 versus uh, S1 monotherapy. Uh, the hypothesis of JCO 9912 trial is uh, uh, comparison of the 5FU plus CPT11 plus cisplatin. Uh, uh, the superiority of a CPT11 plus cisplatin, and then also uh, the uh, non inferiority of the S1 compared to the 5FU uh, uh, monotherapy. This is the uh, uh, final result of the uh, JCOG 9912 trial. And uh, CPT11 plus cisplatin does not show the superiority uh, compared to the 5FU infusion. But the S1 shows a non inferiority compared to the 5 FU. And the hazard uh, ratio and the, uh, the survival benefit is uh, uh, relatively higher uh, in S1 compared to the 5 FU uh, infusion. And then the adverse event is uh, uh, highest in the cisplatin combination. And the neutropenia was uh, uh, really 3 4 neutropenia was seen. 
uh, in uh, CPT11 plus cisplatin, uh, 65.0%, and favorite nitropenia was 9.4%. And the nausea and appetite loss was a uh, very, very high rate in the cisplatin combination therapy. So uh, they conclude this one is a uh, non fidelity and uh, lower toxicity uh, compared to the 5FU and the CPT11 cisplatin. And the CPT11 cisplatin uh, shows a high, uh, to higher toxicity and did not show the superiority to 5FU monotherapy. So uh, the S1 should be considered for the new standard of care for the advanced gastric cancer. And then uh, at the same time, the split trial was done uh, compared to the S1 monotherapy versus S1 plus C uh, therapy. Uh, the primary point is uh, overall survival. And the uh, overall survival shows us uh, the superiority in the S1 plus C arm compared to the S1 monotherapy arm. Uh, with a significant, uh, statistically significant uh, differences. Uh, the median survival time was uh, uh, 11, for, or 11 months for this one monotherapy and 13 months for this one plus this protein. And the hazard ratio was uh, 0.774 and the p value was 0 .3, uh, 0 0.0366. And the response rate is uh, uh, significant higher in the S1 plus this protein. Uh, with uh, uh, 54%, and the, on the other hand, uh, only 31% in this one arm. The worst event is, uh, of course, uh, higher in the cisplatin arm, uh, but in the rate of the, uh, the neutropenia and the anemia and the petite rose, uh, is uh, acceptable to in uh, S1 plus cisplatin. So 30% of the appetite loss and the 12% of nausea was seen in the S1 plus cisplatin. But there are no treatment related tests was seen in the S1 plus cisplatin. So after the JCOG 9912 and the S3 trial, uh, the S1 plus cisplatin uh, regimen can be regarded as a first regimen uh, for the advanced gastric cancer in Japan. And after uh, in the 20, uh, 2000, uh, the many uh, uh, clinical trial was done for the gastric cancer. So uh, at the time that we have uh, four uh, active drugs uh, for the advanced gastric cancer. So how uh, should we do with combined with C cancers uh, along with uh, using the four active drugs? So first of all, we evaluated the triplet, uh, three drug combination therapy. And in uh, England, layer two was done, uh, comparison with uh, epirubicin, cisplatin, fluorosyl process, epirubicin, cisplatin, uh, capacitabin, zeroda, and the uh, epirubicin, oxaliplatin, fluorosyl, and the epirubicin, oxaliplatin, zeroda. So, uh, this uh, trial uh, uh, evaluated the repositioning of the uh, uh, 5FU to the zero the oral, oral fluoromaging, and the, uh, at the same time the cisplatin uh, repositioning to reposition to the oxide platin. After the, uh, uh, the final result, the uh, Oxaliplatin shows a non inferiority compared to the cisplatin. Oxaliplatin is uh, uh, the same, uh, similar drug uh, with a, a, a so called platinum uh, drug, but it uh, uh, lower uh, uh, gastrointestinal toxicity uh, and it uh, uh, does not need to uh, hydration. And so the oxalic protein is a very useful and convenient uh, compared to a cis protein. So oh, uh, the are two drug, the are two tri uh, trials show the uh, non inferiority of the oxalic protein compared to the cis protein in advanced gastric cancer. In Japan, uh, the GSOX trial shows a uh, uh, was down uh, compared to the S1 plus cisplatin uh, compared to the S1 plus oxaliplatin. 
uh, in the progression free survival, uh, the uh, S1 plus axial platin shows a non inferiority compared to the S1, the S1 plus platin. And uh, uh, in overall survival, they have a, uh, they show the tendency of the uh, non inferiority of the S1 plus oxide platin. Uh, so uh, we can uh, do the uh, oxide platin um, uh, at the same as uh, cis platin for gastric cancer. But after fair for the 5 and the platinum agent, what should we do uh, in the uh, or taxan? And in uh, Germany, uh, there is a, a, a the randomized uh, control trial was done. Uh, comparison with the best of supportive care uh, with uh, Inutukan uh, for the second line uh, gastric cancer patient after fair for the uh, first line fluoropigin plus uh, plasma agent. Uh, the trial was uh, terminated due to the uh, low accrual of the patient, but it, uh, uh, only uh, with a 40 uh, patient, uh, Inutukan shows a survival benefit compared to the best of supportive care. Uh, from the Korean trial, uh, the similar trials was done comparison with the chemotherapy uh, versus special supportive care. And the, uh, the, uh, the uh, second line chemotherapy shows a survival benefit uh, compared to special supportive care. So uh, we should do the chemotherapy uh, for the patient after failure for the first line chemotherapy if uh, the patient uh, have a good uh, performance status. In Japan, uh, the comparison with active drugs uh, was done, uh, Pacritaxel versus uh, CPT-11 uh, in the WJOG 4007. Uh, the two drugs uh, uh, show the uh, uh, active uh, survivals, uh, but it is slightly better in the Pacritaxel as seen. And the, uh, of, uh, uh, I would like to uh, add a comment, uh, the Inzuka um, does not uh, treat it uh, for the patient who have a uh, uh, bowel obstruction and the uh, ascites. Uh, but the uh, pacritaxel can be done uh, for the such kind of patient. So uh, in Japan, the pacritaxel is more uh, uh, considered as a, a standard care for the second rank at the gastric cancer patient. Uh, this is uh, uh, the Japanese guideline for the advanced gastric cancer uh, 2015. The after fera for the S1 plus platinum agent, the second line is a pacritaxel or doxitaxel, and after the fera for the second line, third line was uh, should be done or with the And the, uh, like uh, other uh, cancer types like uh, lung cancer and uh, uh, colorectal cancer. Uh, the wave of the target therapy uh, helps calm uh, in for the gastric cancer. Uh, for example, the HER2 inhibitor and the EGFR inhibitor and anti-angiogenesis. And in the, uh, in the gastric cancer, the HER2 uh, overexcision was uh, uh, seen in the 20 to 30% of the patient. And the EGFR was uh, 30 to 50 percent, and the uh, MET and the EGFR2 and the other uh, target uh, is uh, overexpression in gastric cancer. So, firstly, uh, trosomal anti heart antibody, uh, which are approved for the, uh, the uh, breast cancer, it was tested in the TOGA trial. Uh, TOGA study is a comparison is a first line uh, gastric cancer patient uh, with HER2 positive patient. And the, uh, the uh, baseline chemotherapy was uh, XP, a capacitabine plus uh, cisplatin or 5FU or uh, 5FU plus uh, cisplatin. Uh, plus minus trastuzumab was uh, evaluated in this study. Uh, this is uh, a primary result of the TOGA study. And the, the addition of the first line chemotherapy of the uh, trastuzumab shows the uh, uh, obvious survival benefit uh, compared to the uh, chemotherapy alone. In all patients, 
the hazard ratio was 0 0.74, but it uh, uh, only uh, the, the evaluation in the only with the H2 uh, IC please plus and uh, 2 plus plus fish positive patient, the hazard ratio is elevated to the 0 0.65. So now uh, the indication of the trastuzumab is uh, restricted for the uh, IC3 plus uh, or IC2 plus and fish plus uh, gastric cancer patient. After that, uh, the H2 uh, antibody conjugated with a uh, drug uh, extecan, uh, named the uh, Trasmab uh, Dilukstikan uh, was uh, evaluated in the uh, Destiny Gastric 01 trial. Uh, this is uh, uh, for the patient after fair for the uh, two uh, more than two prior regimen uh, compared to the uh, Trasmab Dilukstikan process fish and choice. Uh, shows that. Uh, the trastuzumab deluxetan uh, shows a uh, five of uh, fifty one point three percent of the smooth rate compared to the fourteen point three percent of the fish and toys. In the overall survival, the uh, significance in the trastuzumab deluxetan, the old patient uh, received the uh, trastuzumab, uh, the first line uh, chemotherapy. But it, uh, after fair for the uh, uh, trastuzumab, the trastuzumab deluxetan shows a uh, uh, good response uh, even after the resistance of the trastuzumab. And the uh, progression free survival is also uh, higher in the trastuzumab deluxetan. So, uh, trastuzumab deluxetan uh, just approved in Japan the last uh, year. Uh, Ramsimab is the uh, anti bgfr 2 uh, antibody and it broke the anti angiogenesis of the cancer therapy. And approved for the, uh, the uh, colorectal cancer and lung cancer. And the, uh, the BGFR uh, uh, connected the, uh, the pathway of the anti angiogenesis through the BGF-A, BGF-C, and BGF-D. Uh, rainbow trials was done in Japan and globally. Uh, the comparison of the Pacritaxel placebo versus Pacritaxel plus uh, for the patient of the second line uh, chemotherapy. And the overall survival shows the survival benefit uh, of the uh, Ramushima plus Pacritaxel arm. So uh, uh, the, we recognize as the standard care uh, of the second line chemotherapy with the Pacritaxel plus Ramushima. And the, the legal trial was done uh, without uh, Japan. Uh, this is uh, a comparison uh, with a vessel uh, supportive care with uh, Ramushiva monotherapy for the second line gastric cancer patient. Also, the Ramushiva shows a uh, uh, survival benefit uh, uh, compared to the vessel supportive care. So, Ramushiva monotherapy is uh, one of the uh, candidates for the uh, 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 patient who cannot receive the uh, chemotherapeutic agent. So after the uh, result of the rainbow trial, the, uh, the Japanese guideline for the reverse uh, cancer, cancer is uh, changing. The second line uh, standard of care uh, is a uh, weekly pacritaxel plus ramucimab. And the, uh, for the patient with a poor condition, the weekly pacritaxel, or docetaxel, or inotecan, or ramucimab monosapi was applicable. And after the fair for the second line, the third line, uh, chemotherapy was used with uh, uh, the drugs, uh, which was not used uh, for one uh, chemotherapy. And the, uh, the many uh, clinical trials was done with the uh, targeting agent. But it, uh, uh, most of them was failed to show the survival benefit. For example, uh, the blue one, the rapatinib and the pirutumab and TDM1, or cetaxumab, uh, panitumab, 
、荷物は、エルペバシズマ、リモツマ、ドビチニブ、エベロリムス、エベロマ、オラパリブは、ああ、ハーバーフェイルド、トゥーショー、ダポジティブレザルト、オリダラムシューマ、エンドトラスマ、エンドトラスマ、デリクスティカン、エンドニボロマ、ハーバー、シューン、ダポジティブレザルト。So recently, the immune checkpoint inhibitor、uh, shows a benefit for the、uh, many、uh, cancer types.、Uh, checkpoint inhibitor、uh, blocks the、uh, PD1 or PDL1 uh, binding uh, with uh, uh, T cell plus、uh, tumor cells. And then the、uh, immune checkpoint inhibitor、uh, reactivates the、uh, T cell and the T cell attacks the、uh, tumor cell again. Uh, for the gastric cancer、uh, patient, the attraction to clinical trials was conducted for the third line chemotherapy of the gastric cancer patient.、Uh, this is comparison of the placebo and nivolumab monotherapy、uh, in the Asian patients, Japan and Korea and Taiwan. And in the 30,、uh, 330 patients、uh, assigned to the nivolumab arm and the 163 patients assigned to the placebo arms. And in the、uh, 45 patients、uh, enrolled from Japan and South Korea and 10% from Taiwan. The most of them had the gastric cancer and the only the 10% of the patients. Uh, had the、uh, espago、uh, gastric junctional、uh, cancer. Overall response shows uh, only uh, 12% in the volume arm and 0% for、uh, placebo arm. But、uh, this is controlled to as、uh, 40% in the volume arm and 20% for placebo arm.、Uh, this is the primary endpoint of this trial. And the nivolumab model shows a survival benefit、uh, compared to the placebo arm. And the radiance、uh, OS was 5.3 months for nivolumab arm and 4.1、uh, for placebo arm. And amazingly, the、uh, one year overall survival rate was 27% for the nivolumab and 12% for、uh, two years、uh, overall survival rate. Uh, progression free survival、uh, shows better in、uh, nivolumab also.、Uh, we experienced、uh, some patients、uh, who achieved uh, uh, special, uh, special response with、uh, nivolumab monotherapy.、Uh, the 62 years old male、uh, have a nivolumab as the fifth line of chemotherapy for the gastric cancer. After the、uh, administration of the nivolumab, The six weeks、uh, after nivolumab administration, the CT showed the、uh, shrink of the liver metastasis. And after one year, almost uh, the, uh, the liver metastasis was gone. And then、uh, after three years,、uh, the response was、uh, continued durable. Now, one more case. Is also 67 years old male, and、uh, they have a, a lymphonode metastasis in the upper mediastinal and the, around the celiac artery. And after the,、uh, six, months, uh, six weeks,、uh, the first administration, the nivolumab, and the lymphonode shrinked. In one year and two years, the response was、uh, durable. So, that is、uh, one of the uh, special uh, issue, uh, special one of the nivolumab.、Uh, if the patient had the responses,、uh, the responses, response uh, is durable. So, after the、uh, result of the uh, attraction uh, to trial, The s a d r i n e Sandal Care,、uh, including the Nivolumab and the Rinotecan. And the FTP、uh, PPI shows uh, uh, the survival benefit 
in the other clinical trials and the, uh, one of the candidates for the standard care for third line patient. And second line standard is also uh, paclitaxel plus lamotrigine. And uh, last year, uh, the Attraction 4 trial was uh, represented in ESMO meeting. This is the first line uh, comparison uh, between the uh, uh, SM plus oxaliprazine uh, plus minus nivolumab. Uh, this trial is held in the Japan, uh, Korea, and the Taiwan. And uh, um, the uh, so this is the um, primary result of the attraction for trial. Uh, this trial have a co-primary endpoint uh, with the progression-free survivor and the world survivor. The progression-free survivor uh, shows a, a significance with the NIVO uh, combo. Uh, the progression-free survivor, a uh, median progression-free survivor, uh, achieved uh, more than 10 months. And the hazard ratio was 0 0.68. Uh, but the, um, the overall survival does not show the uh, survival benefit with uh, a NIVO combo or arm. Because um, many of the patients received uh, uh, subsequent chemotherapy uh, after failure for the first line uh, chemotherapy with nivolumab. In Japan, the uh, nivolumab was approved and the, we can use for the uh, nivolumab monotherapy. Uh, the subsequent uh, immune therapy uh, may affect the result of the uh, discordant of the progression survival and the overall survival. So, uh, but the overall survival uh, shows 57.5% uh, uh, for the nivo uh, arm. This uh, is amazing for uh, the uh, first line gastric cancer chemotherapy. Uh, as this show, the uh, many of the patients mm, received the uh, nivolumab and the pembrolizumab after failure for the first line chemotherapy treatment in the chemotherapy arm. At the same time, the checkmate 649 uh, trial, uh, which uh, conducted globally, was presented in SMO 2020 meeting. This is a comparison between the uh, Forofox or uh, Capeox plus minus Nibolumab. And the, uh, around the 500 patient uh, was enrolled uh, in both arm uh, of the this trial. And the, the 20, only 25% of the patient enrolled from Asian countries. Uh, this trial shows a uh, uh, survival benefit in progression free survival, even in the overall survival, with a hazard ratio uh, with a 0 0.68 and the, uh, for the progression free survival and 0 0.71 for the overall survival. The primary endpoint of this trial is the progression free survival and overall survival of the uh, CPS more than 5 patients. Uh, CPS means uh, uh, combined uh, positive score uh, for the PDL1. Uh, the higher CPS uh, score uh, achieved the higher responses with the uh, immune checkpoint inhibitor. Uh, so, uh, this is a, a good result for the gastric cancer. But at the same time, uh, the all uh, the survival uh, overall survival in all patient with uh, including the uh, CPS raw uh, patient was uh, evaluated, and the, the survival overall survival uh, was uh, significant in the uh, chemo nivolumab combo arm, even in the uh, all uh, patient uh, uh, regardless of the CPS score. So in all subgroups, uh, chemo plus nivo combo shows a, a survival benefit in the overall survival and the progressive in survival. And recently, uh, USM FDA approved for or, uh, approved uh, the nivolumab 
uh, for the all uh, the gastric cancer patient uh, with uh, uh, for the first line chemotherapy. Uh, this is a, uh, the uh, a subgroup analysis of the uh, checkpoint six a four nine trial. In the all subgroups and the chemo plus uh, nipo shows a better tendency uh, with uh, oral survival. So after the result of the attraction 4 and the uh, checkmate 649 trial, uh, the, for the first line chemotherapy, uh, the chemo plus nevo uh, might be the uh, standard of care uh, for the first line chemotherapy. And also the heart positive patient, the chemo plus trasumab is also uh, uh, and uh, uh, for the third line um, chemotherapy uh, with the uh, heart positive patient, trastuzumab so deruxtecan uh, would be the standard of care uh, in Japan. So this is the summary and the uh, conclusion. And uh, recently the uh, the result, uh, positive result with the uh, immune checkpoint inhibitor. Uh, the first line chemotherapy would be the uh, 5FU plus platinum, S1 plus capistabine plus cisplatin uh, or oxaplatin plus uh, nivolumab. In the second line uh, chemotherapy, uh, paclitaxel renatecan uh, with ramucinumab. Uh, and the heart supportive patient uh, used uh, by the trastuzumab. And the, uh, the more uh, uh, the clinical trial is the trastuzumab, for example, trastuzumab deruxtecan uh, for the secondary chemotherapy was uh, now conducted, and the other uh, target therapy uh, was conducted for the first line chemotherapy. So uh, the uh, the standard of care would be it changes uh, by uh, along with the uh, uh, result of the uh, clinical trials near future. Uh, thank you for attention.